Good morning, everybody. Michelle is here. Hope everybody is doing fantastic, magnificent, and marvelous. Because I am on this Tuesday in the East Coast. I just want you to know that everything's going fantastic on my, you know, in my neck of the woods. Um, I just wanted to stress, you know, I like to pick, pick at my face, eyes, you know, and do whatever I want to do. How about that? Have fun. Just let you know everything is going fantastic as far as my um, uh, process, my journey, you know, my uh, my journey towards my destiny, towards my destination, uh, towards parts unknown, uh, part, part, you know, adventure, whatever, whatever everybody wants to call it. Um, I have been attempting to do these kind of things for a while, but you know, life has a lot of. Uh, other uh, responsibilities as well. Uh, I knew, um, and you know, I'm in a better place, more so mentally, in my psyche, my consciousness, than I've ever been in my life. And so this is par probably why it's the per perfect time for me to do what I want to do. You know, to, to, to you know, take, take a long, 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 long. You know, when I was a young girl, I think I, you know, started driving I remember getting in my vehicle and driving around was very uh, comforting to me because you know you, you I, I was I would be able to visualize and deal with things because we all have something to deal with, okay? And I don't want anyone coming forward thinking your situation is any better or worse than anyone else. We just need to stop that. You know, we're all in this together, okay? All of us have our own experiences and our own perception and our own um, uh, reality and memory of what happened to us. And it's not going to always be the same. So let's keep that clear. Someone's going to remember a certain event differently than another event. Okay, let's make that clear. But let's not just get on here and think that, you know, that so some of us get on here and just want to, you know, kind of bleed out all of the tragedies and the uh, struggles and the difficulties and the, and this and that and the other that they've gone through and that how they've picked themselves up and you know that's that's fantastic to tell people that but why are you telling people that though sometimes you know I told you I've been very open as as open as I can be suspended my ego and everything else to give you you know being transparent to give you the, the full uh perception of what my reality was based on my memory. We all know sometimes our memories are are uh, flawed. I told you I had a period of time where I don't remember certain years of my life, but it comes back in bits and pieces every now and then. So everything, you know, it's funny. I can't, I can't remember periods of my life in that certain period of my life, but I can remember beyond that, you know, when I was a young child and blah, 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 blah. So we all have uh, our realities. Some of it is exaggerated, some of it is false, some of it is an illusion, some of it is delusion. Yet, let's just be very clear that uh, we're all in this together. No one is better than the other or lower than the other and this and that and the other. Let's just just, just tell your story um, and, um, and see how it, how it captures someone at a particular moment in their life. You know, and if you're doing it to help people, I think it's fantastic. But, you know, you need to question your own intentions. And again, you can't fool your consciousness. Not at all. Your consciousness, your subconscious, your psyche, your soul, whatever you want to call it. You can't fool that. You can't. In other words, you can't fool yourself. If you are in it for something other than what you're saying you're in it for, then that's going to be revealed and exposed. It always does. <laughs> So just, 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 you know, again, always be gentle in what you're doing um, and, you know, more so with yourself and just be honest. Look, look at my reality. Who wants to be in my reality? Just be very honest about that. Do I even want to be in my own reality? I love my reality. I love my space I'm in. Okay. Because I know that I put forth the effort, whether it's negative or positive, good or bad, 
to bring me to this point right now. Okay. And it feels good to know that, yes, I can accomplish things and get results. Okay. I have enough experience to uh, walk the talk. All right. I'm just not out there. I'm not out here to, um, you know, be badgering people, you know, you know, picking fights with people and uh, just causing a whole lot of uh, chaos and destruction. We have enough of that going on, honey. Again, it's about love for me. It's about love. I'm doing everything I'm doing right now is for love. Love of myself, love of this planet, and love of people. You know, love is love. And either you understand that or you don't. Okay? Love is, I mean, love is self-love. If you can love someone else, then you can love yourself. If you don't love yourself, you can't say you love anybody else. Okay? And so if you, if you, so, and we all know that the, it's an energy thing, okay? So, you know, admit that you are, that you are spewing hatred also. Admit that to yourself and cut it out and stop attempting to justify hatred towards people, you know, and harm towards people. And targeting people and bothering people when no one's bothering you. Okay, most of the people that are bothering people, you know, they are the ones that possibly are lonely. I don't know. I don't understand what's going on with that. You know, I, all I know is this, it appears to be some type of projection. You know, that something's going on in them and they're projecting it out on, on, on society and blaming society for everything. Instead of saying, you know what, you know. And drop all of this, uh, this self-important, you know, like you're so self-important and just relax. Okay, go roll out in the dirt or in the sun or go take a swim somewhere and snap out of it. How about that? <laughs> but anyway, I'm having fun. Uh, again, I'm giving myself two weeks. So I'm thinking... Let's see. Let's look at the calendar here. You know, I'm ho you know, I'm hoping. Well, let's not say hope. I want to be on the road, you know, by the, um, the, the last week in June. But we'll see. The last week in June, start, you know, doing my thing, baby, and uh, you know, just, um, you know, just taking it where, how I feel, you know, how, you know, always, always paying attention to what I'm sensing and receiving. And so that I can uh, properly make decisions and make sure, you know, my thoughts, that I am controlling my thoughts and managing my feelings, emotions, my senses, all of that. And then I'm paying attention and, you know, and enjoying the moment more, more than anything. And, uh, you know, and uh, getting to my destination, that way I can create other destinations or 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 goals or this and that yeah you know get one goal under your belt and then you know start over and and and, and do something else all right don't stay into don't stay in a journey too long you know if you're giving yourself a time period and it that doesn't happen all right you need to probably start over or refine it or something all right keep yourself refreshed in reality and and at the same time like I said having fun with it and, and taking the load off of yourself, taking the load off of your thoughts. In other words, clear your brain out of all this garbage in there, you know, about self-importance, know it all. I'm better than you. I know more than you do. I'm more knowledgeable. T you know, empty your brain of all that garbage. Okay. And so that you can think clearly and effectively. All right. And make logical decisions. And um, not get yourself in a spin, a spin, a spin where you go nowhere, All right? I hope that was inspirational. And um, I just want to send peace and love all over the stars, over the moon and the mountain. And trust me, I'll be back. <laughs>